A plane carrying ousted Honduran President Manuel Zelaya circled the skies over the country's main airport Sunday, but was prevented from landing by military personnel who blocked the runway. Zelaya instead was forced to land in El Salvador, where he's meeting with other South American leaders on his next move. The interim president of Honduras, Roberto Micheletti, says he will not negotiate with Zelaya until things return to normal in the country. Zelaya was flown out of the country at gunpoint a week ago, and Congress then installed Micheletti in his place. Zelaya's supporters surrounded the airport and scuffled with the military in a protest. One man was killed and more than two dozen were hurt. Zelaya has broad international support for his return. No country has recognized the new government and the Organization of American States has suspended Honduras as a member. Negotiations between the Honduran government and international groups is said to be ongoing. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.